Eli wasn't just good at math, he loved it. While other kids collected baseball cards or toy cars, Eli collected puzzles, brain teasers, and riddles. Numbers felt like his best friends, and he could solve problems faster than a calculator. One morning at school, Eli's teacher, Mrs. Willow, made an announcement. The whole school is invited to the great math challenge. Whoever solves the final puzzle will win a golden trophy. Eli's eyes lit up. He loved a challenge. The contest had three tricky rounds. In the first, Eli had to figure out how many apples were in a giant crate without counting them one by one. He quickly grouped them in sets of 10 and solved it in seconds. In the second round, he had to help a zookeeper figure out how many legs were in the animal yard. There were flamingos, goats, and even kangaroos. Eli zipped through the problem with a big grin. Finally, the last puzzle appeared on the board, a giant maze made of numbers. To get out, you had to add and subtract the right way to find the hidden exit. Eli's pencil flew across the page, scribble, scribble done. The crowd cheered as Eli held up the golden trophy. But what made him happiest wasn't the prize. It was knowing that math could be exciting, creative, and even magical. From that day on, everyone called him Eli the math genius, and he made it his mission to show other kids just how fun numbers could be.